You can create and customize your own fashion and home decor trends through your own style language. When you know your own style language, your authentic self really begins to shine forth. Try beginning with three key words that define your style. Mine are bohemian, earthy, and whimsical. My choice of clothing and what and how I create reflect my own style language. I admire nature, florals, bright colors, and the feeling of happiness. Your style really reflects and expresses who you are on the inside, too. It's time to have fun being creative, and it's also extremely healing and therapeutic. Healing through art and your own self-expression. I found this beautiful free people crochet shawl on Poshmark. It was originally $98. You will not believe I only paid $20 for this with new with tags. It is absolutely beautiful. Look at these gorgeous accented ribbons at the bottom like tassels with the different colors. And it's just such gorgeous crochet work. Those are my little lights. Super soft, super comfortable, perfect for fall or spring. These are my cute little tassel necklaces I hand make too in my Urban Eco Beauty shop. So the shawl totally inspired me to make a cute handmade, my own free people design bag to carry the shawl in because I loved it so much and I wanted to protect it. Because if I'm out, I just want to toss it in a bag or just keep it stored perfectly in my closet. So I made this cute bag and I'm going to show you how to do it. I cut to size a white soft piece of fabric. If you fold it in half, it's the perfect size um, for the bag. And I just started getting creative with it. I stitched the words free people on it and some kind of looking stars. I got this flowered ribbon here, tie dyed fabric. And I took different yarns and just stitched away with a needle white right through the fabric. I didn't have any um, plan I just this is just how it kind of came out because I had all these extra little fabrics that I wanted to use so I put them together on this white piece of fabric here then I had this ribbon this gray ribbon um, and I had this white ribbon so I sewed the white ribbon on top of the gray ribbon and that is going to be the handle for the bag and this is how I started now the bag's flipped over. You can see all my stitching loose ends on the other side where I stitched through to the free peep boards and the star designs and the ribbon attached for the handle. Okay, so this is showing the inside of the bag folded in half. We haven't sewed it together yet. It's just literally the bag's folded in half then we'll have to turn it inside out for to see the outside of the bag on the front. So we're going to sew both ends of the bag straight down this way and straight down the other end and leave the top open, of course. And there's the um, handle for the bag there where I just sewed that ribbon on and I'll show you how to do that too. Now we need our sewing machine. The bag is flipped inside out. We have pinned both ends of the bag so that we know where to stitch. Don't worry about the extra fabric on the ends. We can cut that off or actually just leave it. And that's all the outside stitching loose ends. Now we're going to take this fabric and just sew both ends. For sewing both ends of the bag, we wanna sew the, the bag strap on. I just sewed the bag strap onto the outer side of the bag. Now we're gonna so a straight line down the one end of the bag where all our pins are. This white ribbon I sewed with the sewing machine on top of the gray ribbon just to give it a little accent and have some more fun with it. Now the bag is done. Both of the bag ends are completely sewn. This is the inside of the bag. We're going to have to flip it inside out to see the outside. This is what it looks like before we do that and here is our finished bag it came out so cute you can get so creative with this i really just did used extra fabric that i had you can see all my handmade stitching there 
the extra loose ends are in the inside of the bag, so the outside is all clean and neat. You can't see any of that. And the only thing I'd like to fix is the strap. I don't really like the one side of the strap where you can see all the, the stitching there. So we're going to hide that, and I have a trick. I'll show you how. Okay, so we're going to hide this stitching that we see on the other side of the strap. I have this extra kind of tie-dye fabric I didn't know what to do with, so I just like cut a thin strip and I'm going to use fabric glue and just glue it across the whole strap. And I think that might be kind of cute and fun. You could do anything that you like, but this is just what I came up with. Just finished gluing the tie-dye fabric strip to the strap. I have this sequence ribbon, these circles that were linked together, and I just cut them apart. I took some of the tie-dye fabric, cut in a circle, cut another circle, and just sewed those pieces together. And I had some little white flower ribbon, cut that, and made just a little art design I'm going to add to the bag. So I just glued that little circle sequence thing I made to the back of the bag because the back was totally plain and didn't have anything. Here's the front of the bag. It's totally done now. It came out adorable. I love it. The fabric is nice and soft, so it'll be perfect to carry a really soft crochet shawl around. It's done. I absolutely love it. Now I can carry my little shawl around in this cute bag, and it will be super protected. And now you can see how easy it is to make any tote bag and have fun with it and add extra stitching and just be super creative and add your own unique style. If you were inspired by this creative artistic project, now it's on to the next. everyone it's the Nora Moon I want to give a great big thank you and love to all my supporters and everyone checking out my videos and my organic skincare line at urbanecobeauty.com uh, health and wellness sonoramoon.com and joining me in talking about our spiritual life serving our Heavenly Father Yahweh in heaven through his son Yeshua I want to send love and blessings and prayers to all of you thank you so much Join our healthy living journey at sonoramoonlifestyle.com.